Hey, how you doing? I'm uh, Will Hunt with uh, Evanescence, and we're over here in Russia right now on a nice little fall tour where it's actually winter here. <laughs> uh, I started playing drums when I was five. Um, I saw Kiss on TV. This is probably not an original story for a lot of people because um, I think a lot of people started playing music my age because of Kiss, you know. It was a, a visual, such a visual thing, but I saw Kiss on a TV show, and um, you know they look like superheroes, comic book heroes, you know. And, um, and besides that, you know the music definitely did something to me, and I really, you know, dug that. And uh, my father's a musician, um, and uh, so there's always instruments around the house, and there are people in the house playing all the time. And um, I think that you know my original instrument was guitar and I just couldn't seem to get my hands around that neck and make it work and so I said okay well drums you know so that's how you know just kind of I think they chose me I don't think I chose drums. Our sound guy Eddie Mapp he is who turned us all on to the company and the mics and um, we're all using these mics now you know Amy sings through them and Troy has them on his guitar cabs and <clears throat> you know they're all over my drums and I think the really cool thing about what they've done with these mics is um, the circuitry that they have going on is, is just cutting edge, and uh, they've taken, I think, a lot, of, you know, a lot of inspiration from things from other companies that have worked really well in the past, and just developed them into this kind of new technology. And with the kick mics themselves, I mean, you can tune the kick mics almost to a point where you don't really have to do too much EQing up front, which is always a great a great thing because as soon as you start EQing stuff and pulling stuff out you lose signal path and you know it's just like if, as flat as you can keep something the better it is and that's I think that's what's really going on with these mics is that we're able to really tune these things kind of at the source to a point where there's not a ton of EQ going on you know at the monitor desk or at the front of house position you know, it just makes for a cleaner mix. One of the most noticeable differences that I've that I've found with these mics is that there's more separation of the instruments, you know, because I, obviously with the drum kit you've got multiple instruments, you know, you've got different size toms, you've got cymbals. It's a full range spectrum of sonics that come from a drum kit that, sh that should come from a drum kit. Um, but what we have here is, uh, like, I just noticed that my highs are more crisp, you know, the low end is really usable and punchy. It's, you know, it sits right where it should be and then the snare just cracks, you know, it's just like, it, I notice a lot of clarity, you know, it really kind of, there's a lot of space in the mix now. The, we had it before, but not this clear. <laughs>